Hey, coaches, I uh, went to the UNC clinic this weekend and uh, had a chance to, to, to listen to Phil Longo talking, and, and we got him started talking about stick routes, and he had a couple just uh, gigantic uh, coaching tips uh, that I think can really improve. I know it's going to improve our stick route, and I think it can help you too. So uh, let's share it. I don't have any video on it. I'm just going to draw it up and kind of explain what he was uh, talking about and how I think it can be an absolute game changer. Uh, first thing is he said these, even for them, this is just a, 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 a hitch, a five-yard uh, five hitch. On the backside, they run double slant, and they run this second one almost like an in cut. And uh, they really like that. Uh, the Z is on an outside uh, vert. And this guy is more of an option for them than he has been for us in the past. And then the big one, and I know this is the age old debate for, uh, for air raid guys, but uh, they, they shoot route this thing and they shoot route it for the reasons that I've always known but he convinced me by just saying this, that he prefers the swing and I'm, I'm a swing guy, but he said two things made them switch over to this is that number one, they, when they started charting completions, their completion rate was a lot higher uh, with the, uh, with the shoot route than it was with the swing. And uh, like I've always known this just this gets out so much faster that it puts a bunch of pressure on the uh, the defense and uh, and when I show you this little innovation it's going to make more sense to you so let's talk this vertical he spent a long time talking about this vertical route and this vertical route for them if they like the matchup is uh, it, it the quarterback can take it anytime they want to. Uh, Obviously, they like good matchups. For us, it's always been he can take it if it's a press, but they don't care what they don't care what kind of coverage it is. If they like the matchup, they're going to take that anytime they want. Now, here was here was something that I think can help us all. He talked about they they did a study and they found out that the vertical route, the shorter the throw, the higher completion it is. So they don't want, you know, a 30, 40 yard bomb. They like something that comes down about 20 yards deep because their completion rate is so much higher. They are huge on the over the shoulder catch. Uh, and they actually have a drill that they work uh, teaching those guys how to how to bend back and make it come over their shoulder, which we're going to add this spring. Uh, so so they're huge proponents of throwing it over the outside shoulder and 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 bending over, making it come over. And they're huge proponents of taking this anytime they got a matchup that they like. So th those are stealing points for me. Now, here was the big one. They teach their guys, the other, the other age old debate for air raid guys is, you know, it, it's shoot or swing. And then it is what progression are you going to stick to, to swing or stick to shoot? Or are you going to shoot to stick, shoot to stick? And even me and George argue over that one. I've always been a stick to swing guy because I, I was a swing guy. This is what Phil Longo is doing. And I, and I had a chance. I took our quarterbacks. Our, our, I have the quarterback, the Y, and the F all in the same class. So on Monday, we finished that way. It was arm day. So we got out of there a little early and we took them outside and we did this and our quarterback immediately loved it. This is what they're doing. They're putting their eyes, the quarterback's eyes are going right here, the middle point between these two. And so that he can see both of them at the same time. So how does Phil Longo read it? He reads them both at the same time. If the and, and we had a, a walk player out there and he was jumping back and forth trying to screw up the quarterback and the quarterback was a hundred percent right every single time when he when he got just put his eyes right in the middle and then fired it off and they have some words I think it was screaming and uh, one of them was screaming but you know Phil Longo's big on you know the thousand dollar throws you know uh, if it, if you're willing to bet a thousand dollars on it take it so. Uh, with, with just and, and again you know we were out there for 10 15 minutes but the quarterback immediately picked up on this concept of reading them both at the same time and he was 100 he was never wrong we probably got 15 reps 
he was never wrong. He always had the right guy, and it just it was just super simple for him. And he's a sophomore, upcoming junior, uh, and he's going to be pretty dang good. So, so we're we're definitely stealing this one. So we're stealing the vertical concept of you can take it anytime you like the matchup. We're stealing this concept of reading them both at the same time. We're changing from swing to shoot route because it gets out so much faster. And then I haven't decided for sure on this one, but you know their concept is. You know, what, what do you do? And, and I've had teams do this. What do you do? You know, let's pretend this guy's not here. That was, that's just where the quarterback's putting his eyes. But what do you do when this guy runs here and the mic expands here and they're doing it so flat and so good that they are uh, disrupting the stick route? Well, that's where these concepts come in, is that if that mic vacates, then this first slant's a gimme anytime you want it. So uh, that that is that's the concept behind why they're doing it that way. I haven't decided if we're going to steal that part of it yet, but we might just because uh, man, it was really impressive uh, just hearing him talk. He spent over an hour talking about this play, and probably probably thirty minutes of it was on this uh, this vertical route and how they teach vertical and how they uh, increase the percentages on vertical route. So uh, great, great, uh, great clinic. Uh, obviously, anytime you get to be with Phil Longo and listen to him, the guy's a genius and it's always good to, to steal some of his ideas, but uh, really uh, gave me some stuff that I think is going to make us a lot better this year. And I think it could help you too. All right, man. Uh, Please subscribe. We're so close to uh, 4,000. Please subscribe, like, share, do all the YouTube stuff. Uh, hey, man, and buy my course. Thank you.